for uh, what does the strugglers movement stand for is this a political party uh, we are not a political party and i'd like to state that very clear we are not a political party we are a lobby movement it surprises me that most people think we are a political party affiliated to so and so and who's not and who's in but we're not we are there to stand for what the people deserve we want to educate the masses and tell them that at this point in time we are struggling in this country we are struggling to meet our ends meets we as a young kenyan 23 years of age i leave campus in the next few months i have a help loan i need to pay but i'll go for an unpaid internship i am struggling so why should I sit down and say I'm linked to a political party that has clearly, two political parties rather, that have clearly failed me as a young Kenyan? No, we are okay. not a political party. We are a lobby group yeah. that is formed to ensure that Kenyans know yeah. what they deserve. We are tired of promises in this country. I don't want to be promised a job. I want a practical example. I want a practical person to tell me, you know what, this is how we are going to give you jobs. We have SMBs in this country. This is what we are going to do. SMBs, we put in proper policies for these SMBs. Seven out of 10 businesses in this country right now are SMBs. How many people do they employ? Several people. So what's the point to tell me that I'm giving you jobs? No. Give me policies on those SMEs so that I can be able to work hard and ensure that I earn my living. I don't expect handouts, and that's why I'm a struggler. So how are you going to push for these policies if you're not a, a lobby, if you're not a political party, you don't have anyone whose agenda you're supporting? How will your agenda come to fruition? In the art of politics, lobbying comes first. That's what I believe. I'm a political science student and lobbying comes first. You don't make laws minus lobbying. And this is why we want to be there. We are not fence sitters. We want to stand there and tell you, you know what, leader X, this is not the way to go. We have enough we have enough innovators in this country. We don't need MNCs to come to our country, give us obsolete technology. That is where we want to stand. We want to be open about this conversation. We don't want to be hoodwinked, being given handouts. No, we just want to stand there and tell them and call them out. And taking a stand, we will not be able to call them out. It, can, it is very clear, even in this current government, people took stands from the word go, from who is president of what to who is leader of what. Can they make the proper decisions? No, they cannot, because they have an allegiance to something. And as Strugglers Movement, we do not want to make an allegiance to anyone because we want to stand for the truth. So you're not going to pledge any allegiance to any of these political teams? Not so far. Uh, not, it's very early to do so. It's very early to think that we'd want to make an allegiance. And if our movement decides to make an allegiance to anyone, yeah. I believe it will be a real person. Okay.